Welcome back to Unlocked Crafts. Nice to see everyone. Today we are doing the horse rice mosaic. Hopefully uh, you'll enjoy it and I made it quite a short, shorter than most of my other mosaics because you guys have seen enough of my videos to know exactly what's going on. At the end of this video I show you how to do it, put it in a picture frame. So enjoy! I am working on the browns today. And I've already gotten the white and the eyes done. I got it. And all I'm doing here is pushing down the rice so that it is flush with the canvas. Okay, here we are back again. And this is the last little bit of the canvas of the horse that we're doing. All we have to do is fill in the last little bit of the sky area. And that's going to take a few minutes here. You see the white glue right now, but once it dries, that will not be noticeable at all. You will not see it because it dries clear. I use the Car Kamar varnish from Krylon. There's a little number 1312 behind it. I used to be able to get this at Michael's and I am no longer able to. Don't know why they don't carry it anymore. But I got it from Amazon and I don't remember the price of it but you want to spray this outside because it does have a strong smell so you don't want <coughs> excuse me you don't want to uh, spray it indoors okay so this is going to dry now and while this is drying I am going to show you how I prepare the um, the frame for it. I use a small, um, I got this from Walmart. The sticker is starting to rub off, but they're little hinges. I mean, they're little uh, picture frame uh, hinges that you can buy in the department of where the sinks and stuff are. The, uh, Damn it. Hardware department. That's it. Hardware department. But find this in the hardware department. Uh, you can use any size you want. I use. Oh, huh, that one doesn't have a double side to it. These two though. Now, they have double sides. One has the two. Okay, I'm gonna put that down. You have the two hooks right there and you have the multiple hooks on the other side and I put it so that you can use the multiple hooks and they got the small little screws or nails rather they're really small so I use my tweezers to start the nails in the board. Okay, there we go. And since it's 8 by 8, I went ahead and bought from Michaels an 8 by 8 shadow box. I already took off all the trimmings plastic off of it and these little tabs are actually connected to the frame itself that's why these work really well for your mosaic and you'll take all that bend them down bend them back to release your 
your frame backing, your little placeholder, and your glass. Okay, now I will be cleaning the glass with glass cleaner later. Now, this makes a lot of noise, so I am going to turn off the sound so you guys don't have to put up with the noise part of it. But I'm going to put one there, and I'm going to put the other one over here. That way they're evenly spaced, and they can be hung on the wall when the customer is ready to hang them up on their walls. Close up the glue here. So, there we go. I'm going to turn off the sound just because of this is really noisy when you when it hammers. And the frame is ready to go for when I have my mosaic protected. So I am going to go and protect my mosaic and I'll bring it back in and I will finish this part of instruction. Be right back guys. Okay, so we are back from outside spraying this. It's dry. So I am putting it upside down in the frame. Oh wait. First you put your glass, which I did not clean yet. I'm gonna go ahead and clean that with alcohol real quick. You can clean it with alcohol or uh, Windex, either one works. We will put the glass in. Put your spacer back in. your canvas back in there and you turn your little tabs back down to hold your canvas in place because that becomes the back of your um, photo. And there you have it. We are all completely finished with the rice mosaic. Thank you for watching Unlocked Crafts today. Hope that you enjoyed the video and that it was somewhat entertaining. And don't forget to hit the like and the subscribe button on the bottom. Have a great day.